Hey guys, Radio Piper here. How's everybody doing tonight? I'm doing pretty good. Smoking my Medico Bent Stem Pipe. <laughs> I don't think there's really a name for it, so I just call it the Bent Stem. Does it for me. In it, I am smoking. Uh, Colts Gold Rush. Pretty good. A couple new things to talk to you about. I don't know if you guys remember that, uh, that video I did saying that I got that package from Four Noggins and it was a uh, a pipe briar block, uh, Ebishon block. Well, I have it back. I guess that it was, I gave it to my father in law, but uh, he don't smoke pipe. Thought he'd get into it. He didn't. He was like, Well, you still smoke pipe, so he gave it back to me. So, I'll show it to you. Now, it's not the best. Uh, made a little mess up with the bowl, but I'll show you. Anyway, well, there it is. I don't know if you can see that too good. Here's the, the bowl. See how it's like thin on the one side? It's because I cut it too much. <laughs> Had a few curse words for that. What? And I stained it with some cherry stain and put some clear uh, I don't know what you call it liqueur or varnish onto it I rounded the bottom a little bit so it sits pretty nice nice uh, nice draw onto it I put a silver water, uh, a washer into there to make it kind of, you know, break it up between the brown and the black. And what I was wondering, guys, about this stem. I find it kind of fat. <coughs> kind of long. Um, would there be a way for me to maybe short, shorten it a little bit? You know, who's got to here or so? If so, let me know. If not, then I'll have to deal with it. The next thing I made today was a tamper. I don't have a tamper. I never use a tamper until it's like the end of my lighter. So I had a old pool cue downstairs. What I did was I cut the end off. And that's what I made out of it. Took my Dremel tool and put some uh, swirls into it. And for the bottom, I just put a screw. <laughs> I know, pretty lame, but hopefully it does the job. Just give me a second to grab my coffee. Wife made me a coffee. Thank you. Tim Hortons. Yes, I am Canadian. Love Tim Hortons. But well, it's not Tim Hortons. It's uh, Folgers. Uh, lively Colombian with a Keurig. Mm, did a good job, kids. Yeah. Anyway, back to this tamper. So I put the screw in because I didn't have anything else. Uh, metal to stick on the bottom. Pretty good. Made it a little big. That's all right. There's the job. I'm enjoying this pipe making thing. 
well, pipe designing because I didn't have to drill the holes or anything for the, for that block, but it's fun. And this was like last, last year when I got that, so I've had that for a while. Anyways, um, my father-in-law gave me some, some wood. I'll show you. Hang on. Hmm. He says it's hickory. See? The other side. It's been drying out here. It's been out here since last summer. That's one piece. We got big RP. Quite big, this one. <laughs> um, turn around. Now notice it's all cracked here. Right here in the middle. So I don't know if, the, if it's too dry now to make anything out of. Another recommended briar, you know. I've seen some other pipes made out of pear wood. That looks interesting. Anyway. Back. So what do you guys think? Think that'd be alright to try to make a pipe out of them? Where would you start with that? Excuse me. Because I have no idea. Like... Would you uh, cut it all and find your shape of your like your bowl and your shank, like the, and then just buy a stem? I'm assuming that's the thought. That's what, you know, that's what I thought. Nice day here in Canada. Not as warm as it was last week, though, but. That's all right. At least there's no snow. <laughs> uh, what else do I want to talk about? Uh, well, that's quick. I think I was going to run through that that fast. This gold deluxe, gold rush, gold deluxe, something like that. <laughs> Was out last night picking wild garlics. We got a whole shitload of them. Which is good because my wife and I love them. My in-laws love them. And if you guys don't know what wild garlics are, I'll just try to explain. Uh, here in Ontario we have the flower, the Ontario, the province flowers, the trillium, white flower, a few petals on it. I believe it's yellow on the inside. Anyways, where you see those, usually out in the bush, you'll see these other leaves, like mixed in with the trilliums. They look like longer, fatter pieces of grass. And they're wild garlics. And they're very good. Fry them up with some steak. You can eat them out of the jar just like that. Put them in the jar with some vinegar or some water. Turn out real nice. So <clears throat> 
Whew. That snork is through my nose there. Whew. A little funky tonight. Anyways. Um, I've been barbecuing a lot. Not time of year, eh? Screw cooking in the house. Plus everything tastes better on the grill, right? Anyways, we had last night we had these steaks. Peppered steak. And I got this, uh, I think it's Clubhouse marinade. It's a mesquite marinade. Like a 30 minute marinade or something. Amazing. Uh, if you guys ever see it out in your grocery store and you like that kind of uh, like smoky flavor, pick it up. Try it out. It's awesome. I recommend it. This can be a short video for me, guys, because I can't remember anything else to talk about. So yeah, if you guys uh, probably hear a phone ringing, it's all right. <laughs> if you guys can let me know on this stem, or if I'm just stuck with it for now, let me know, guys. Let me know what you think of this. I know it's not the best. You know, it's no uh, Giacomo or Fat Bastard or Joe Case or even a Balkovic. But, you know, practice makes perfect, right? I think the next one I want to get is a straight stem, though, because I want a poker. I want a poker real bad. <laughs> A little stubby poker. Mmm, those are sweet. Let me know what you guys think of my little, uh, my little tamper jobby here. You know, it's not the best work of art, but. Does a job for me. Alright, guys, what's the beard piper here? Bearded Piper, sorry. <laughs> uh, I'll talk to you later. Alright, happy smoking.